Hey guys, so today I'm going to be doing my everyday winter makeup routine and um, yeah, I've been wearing the same makeup for a few weeks now so I figured I'd make a video on it um, while it's still winter. Of course, you're going to want to apply primer so I'm going to be using the, my little mini Herm Decay Primer Potion. I think this thing is so adorable. So, And this is just the original one. Then I'm going to take my Maybelline Color Tattoo, and this is the exact same color as Barely Beige, but it's like the newer one, and this is Barely Branded, and put that all over my lid and on my inner corner, and it is a little messy, but honestly, I'm putting eyeshadow over it, so I don't really care. And then we get into the fun part, and I've been using my Urban Decay Naked Palette every single day for like a month now, and I am obsessed with it. The only thing is that this does get dirty really easily, and the lettering, like... Wears off. Like that happened in like three days. So I'm like trying like not to touch the letters because like I don't want it to like look like that. Like this is my naked palette and like there's like nothing there. But yeah. And this is what it looks like. I know you guys are like, wow, Rachel, I've seen this like 30,000 times. But I don't really care. So I'm going to be taking Virgin and that is the first color. It's super gorgeous and I'm obsessed with it. And I'm just going to be using the brush that comes with it. And I'm going to take Virgin. And put that all over my lid. And I am looking in my mirror, so sorry. And that is how that looks. I think that it is literally like the prettiest color ever. I'm obsessed with it. And then I'm just going to be taking a blending brush and the color Naked. And it's the third color. It's just a super, super light matte brown. And I think that this is really pretty, so I'm just going to take this on a fluffy brush and tap off the excess and then just apply this into my crease. And it's super neutral, but it still defines the crease really well. And I think it looks amazing with this color. I think they literally just go perfectly together. And then I take my Wet n Wild Brulee with just a kind of like angled brush and I just apply this to my brow bone. And this is like the best brow bone color ever and then take my covergirl champagne this has been my inner corner highlight like the entire year i did a top 12 video like 30 times and this was in it now i'm gonna take my love and beauty um gel eyeliner and this is just a black gel eyeliner and i really recommend checking out love and beauty makeup because it's super cheap and it's actually really good i've hit pan on this one and i'm taking a love and beauty gel or er, eyeliner brush and it's just like that and I'm just going to get this on my brush and apply it to my upper lash line and we'll see if I can get this on camera this should be interesting so I just apply a really thin line And once I'm done with that, I'm just going to curl my eyelashes. And these are the three products that I, um, really I always use these two. And then it's just whatever mascara I use. But this is the one I've been using for months. Just kidding, I got it for Christmas. But yeah, I've been using it literally ever since Christmas. I'm obsessed with it. So yeah, I'm just going to first apply the e.l.f. mascara primer. Now I'm going to use my Maybelline Rocket Volume Express. And this is just, look how tiny that print is. It's in like very black, extreme black, something like that. So yeah, and it's like a rocket, like, ah, I think it's really cute. And I love these colors. I think they're really pretty. And this wine, wine, wand reminds me of the CoverGirl Lash Blast. When I first saw this mascara, I thought that it was another Lash Blast. I'm not even kidding. And once I am done with the mascara, um, my eyelashes are super clumpy today, so don't judge. Um, I'm just going to take my Maybelline Great Lash stuff and just put this on my eyebrows i know that this is really exciting i said i have not been wearing lip products but this is like one of my favorite lip combinations and it's not really very wintry at all but i really like it so okay so i'm going to take my revlon lip butter and again this is not wintry this is like summer because it's really bright but my revlon lip butter and sweet tart and this is again zoomed up so this like isn't focusing at all um, my Revlon Lip Butter and Sweet Tart, and this is a really bright, crazy color, and I'm going to apply just a little bit. Again, I don't want to apply too much because, like I said, it is really bright in winter, 
isn't really the time for like really bright crazy lips so yeah and then I'm going to take my Stila lip glaze and this is in Splendor Splendor yeah and I love this it's like a really pretty pinky color and I'm just going to twist this up and just apply this and that's what that looks like. I really like it. And I think the colors look really good together. So yeah, um, that's my completed winter makeup routine. I hope that you guys enjoyed. Sorry it was a little bit longer than I was hoping. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed. And thanks so much for watching. And leave me some requests down below besides Bath & Body Works collection. Because that has been requested like crazy. So I think I'm going to be doing that video next. After this one. So yeah, thanks so much for watching. And please subscribe and leave some requests down below.